Hello, welcome to my YouTube channel. All right, so um, this is construction. You need the pins, of course. You need the ruler. You need the protractor, the compass. Okay, so let's go to question A. Construct triangle PQR in which PQ is 10 centimeters. QR is uh, uh, 8 centimeters. And, uh, and uh, angle PQR is 50 degrees. So let's start by constructing... Uh, PQ. So you, you, you do this, make a faint line like this, and then you say this here is your P. Okay, so now let's find where our Q will be. Remember, they have said it's 10 centimeters, so we need to measure where 10 centimeters will be. So you measure on your compass. So this is uh, 0 from 0 to 10 is uh, here. Just open a bit. So this is my 10 centimeters. So you go to your point P. Mark. So it's, it's here. So Q is uh, here. This is where Q is. So make your line dart now from P to Q. So you need to be very smart. So this is the uh, PQ. So from here, you can now measure the angle. They are saying 50 degrees. And on how to identify where the angle will be, you go to the letter which is in between, in this case Q. So the angle will be here, not at P, it will be at Q. Because Q is the one which is in between. And that's where the angle sign is. So go to point Q. You see this point here? Take it here. Okay. And uh, you follow the line here. Like this. So check. This is 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. 50 is uh, over here. So you make a point like this. So from here, you can join using a faint line. So use your faint line to join. So I've used my faint line to join. So after joining, they're saying it's 8 centimeters. So from P to R, it's 8 centimeters. So you can get your ruler, measure where 8 centimeters is and bisect. So from Q, from Q To R is 8 centimeters, so it must be somewhere here. So you indicate your point R is over here. So from there, you can join these two points. And this one, make it very dark. Okay, we are done with our triangle. So we go to question... Uh, Question uh, A2. So question A2. They want us to measure this distance. PQ. So distance PQ, you can either use a ruler, you do this, or you can use, uh, you can do this. You measure from here, from here to here. You measure like this and go to your ruler so put that so that you get the readings or the this is uh, this is 7.9 7 point sorry 7.80 centimeters so here you can indicate it's 10 centimeters this is uh, 8 centimeters we are given in the question this and this We've just measured this, which is 70.80 centimeters. So we're done there. So we can go now to question B. Question B, they are saying, on your diagram, within triangle P, Q, R, construct the locus of points which are equidistant from P and Q. So equidistant from P and Q, there are just two letters here, meaning the line should be inside the triangle, and it should be touching the middle part of P and Q. So, 
let's try to do it we make that line so we open the compass more than half bisect a line this side and uh, also this side like that so next will be to take it to the other point bisect here and bisect here to cut where they are meeting so this is a point here to, to help us and this also is a point to help us eh, come up with eh, the point so we can put the, uh, the ruler passing at this point and eh, this point so you bisect or you do you draw a line inside the triangle so that's the line we're talking about we go to the other question they are saying equidistant from P, Q, and R, P. B to equidistance from P, R, and P, Q. So meaning your line should pass in between here, going like this. You check the, num the letter which is common. So P is common. So you go to point P. So bisect here and arc and here. To help you know where the line will pass. Then come to this point, reduce, open, three quarters of the gap. Then uh, you can bisect an arc this side. Also here, you bisect an arc like this. So meaning the line will pass somewhere here. This is where it will pass. So you can now join these two points. That line of yours should be inside the triangle. Then the other question here, they are saying uh, three centimeter, five centimeters from R. So you open on your compass, measure five centimeters from here to here, five centimeters. So go to where P is. And then do an arc like this. So this is five centimeters. So we're done. Now they are saying a point T is with the uh, thin triangle PQR is such that it is 5 centimeters from P. So P is over here, 5 centimeters from P. So it's supposed to be somewhere this side. You see, this is 5 centimeters line. So, line. so it's supposed to be somewhere here, not this side. And uh, equidistant from P and... Uh, Q, P and Q. Label the point T. So equidistance, P and Q equidistance here. So it's just the point is here where they are, they are meeting here. So you just write T here, point T. Another question. Another point X is such that it is less than or equal to five centimeters so less than or equal to five centimeters so it's supposed to be here somewhere here not after this arc it's supposed to be before as you're coming from r before this arc or equal to this arc uh, nearer to q it's this side where q is nearer to q than p and nearer to p q so PQ, the line which is marketing PQ and PR is this one. So nearer to PQ. So PQ is here. So it's supposed to be somewhere here than here. So the point is over here. This is the point X. So now you can label or you can shade like this. Okay, so we are done. Thank you very much for watching. Kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel and watch more and more videos don't forget to comment and like also share my videos so that uh, more and more people can benefit thank you